explored a few ways to use maths for interesting purposes. Often maths is used as a simple attack decay envelope generator, triggering the envelope from a sequenced pattern. With a little bit of modulation, however, that simple attack decay envelope can generate accents, rests, and even some complex rolls and ratchet effects. Let's use a similar setup from our Roland Ira FM kick drum video, using one of the maths channels to shape our kick sound. We'll route a gate sequence to the trigger in on maths to generate a drum pattern. By using the fall knob and vary response knob in this arrangement, we can drastically alter the drum sound from short staccato ghost notes to full big hits. You may notice that when the fall time goes too high, the incoming notes are not triggered. Because the fall time hasn't reached its end point, the new note is prevented from starting. If we employ the CV modulation input for the fall time, we can alter the decay length to create some variation in our pattern. For a more predictable result, we can use a repeating sequence. For a more West Coast inspired approach, a timed random CV source like the Woggle Bug might be an interesting alternative. An often overlooked feature on the maths panel that might be an exciting addition to this approach is the cycle on off input. Using a gate, we can turn the cycle mode on as the voltage rises above 2.5 volts, or off when it falls below that threshold. We can try enabling the cycle by hand, of course, but this is another interesting function to modulate. Of course, the fall time and vary response shape will affect the cycle rolls that are produced. and you may have to tune the amount of ratcheting and variation to your taste. But combining these functions can yield some very exciting and unique patterns that you may not dream up naturally. As always, thanks for watching, and please like, follow, and subscribe.